So let's see, pressurized fluid conduit. So I need fused quartz and conduit binder. So we have loads of conduit binder, but fused quartz comes from an alloy smelter. Okay, and an alloy smelter needs an industrial machine chassis. It needs dark steel, which there's actually dark steel seeds. <laughs> But that needs an induction smelter, which we have. And we have steel and obsidian powder. You can also make it in uh, one of these guys in uh, alloys. So obsidian, coal, and iron. Or s obsidian, coal, and iron. Yeah, let's do obsidian, coal, and iron. That seems pretty easy. Let's just make a load of it in the, uh, in the thing for now. Obsidian, coal, and iron. Seems easy enough. Let's flip an Enderman, man. Just getting all up in my grill. So I'll just chuck these in here and it'll uh, probably take a little while for it to all go in, but... We're already, we still got loads of blazing pyrothium, so that's pretty awesome. Needs more coal. Oh god, it's nighttime too. We gotta make those lunar panels, man. I gotta do that. We gotta put that on the to-do list sleep real quick so before the freaking zombies spawn and stuff it's okay mumsy it's okay let's add lunar lunar conduits to this lunar so lunar panel yeah that's the one lunar panel there we go let's grab some coal real quick all right well i don't think we need much of it so that should be enough but I'm making more of it because we'll eventually make seeds of it. So that way we can uh, do stuff with it. So we need to make pressurized fluid conduits, which needs fused scorch, which needs an alloy smelter. Okay. So an alloy smelter needs a machine sashi, which needs a simple machine sashi, which needs grains of infinity. Interesting. So grains of infinity you can also make seeds from, which uh, maybe we'll do that one day. But... It's an interesting thing. It's kind of cool. Basically, do I have a flint and steel on me? Let's check. I do. I do have my flint and steel. Let's put this stuff away. We'll use it eventually. So, for the grains of infinity, I need to go down to bedrock. Uh, I might just dig straight down. Oh man, we need to we need to check out that temple eventually. And yeah, we're gonna don't do this at home, kids. But we're going. We're going straight down. Down to bedrock. Don't dig straight down, you regret that. But now you feel brave, equip with your spade. Oh man. You knew it was gonna happen, didn't you? I don't even have a bucket of water. <laughs> What's that? Oh, we found diamonds. Sure, why not? I have luck too, so I got 13 from that. Ooh. Oh, come on! <laughs> Freaking chance cubes, man. Oh god, there's oil here too. It's starting the oil on fire. It's making me lag too. Flipping chance cubes, man. Screw that. Jeez Louise. All right. I don't know why I'm not just continually digging straight down. I kind of just, I found a cave and then I'm, I wanted to explore. Let's uh, grab a bit of that because that's just useful. Hey, check it out. We need as much of that as we can get. <laughs> okay. There's a creeper here. I'm not going to let him one shot me. What is that? Or lava crystal? That sounds important. I guess we'll take that. Oh man, look at all this lava. This is crazy. All right, we're getting sidetracked a bit here, but uh, oh man, more of this stuff. Maybe it's not that rare. All right, whatever. All right, let's go over here. We just need to dig. A little bit farther down, and then we'll get to... Oh, come on, really? Bedrock, here we go, finally, we made it to bedrock. Yeah, it took long enough, am I right, guys? So, what you do here at bedrock is 
you take out your flint and steel right there and you start it on fire really ow boom you hear that exploding into grains of infinity there you go we're gonna make the seeds so we're gonna need uh, five of it right we'll get a couple more just in case all right so what was I making this stuff with uh, pressure machine sashi one of these so I need iron iron bars and uh, one of them so let's put all this crap away that I don't need uh, all of that crap. I need this. I need this. I need some iron. There we go. And some iron bars. There we go. Let's do that. That right there. Do that, 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 that. A grain of infinity. Boom. And so this needs to be cooked with, uh, what is it? Industrial dye blend. Which is made out of Black dye, nether quartz, dust. What in the heck? Are you kidding me? <laughs> Not edible. Avoid contact with eyes. In case of contact with eyes, rinse immediately with plenty of water and seek medical advice. Pulverized coal and a slime ball makes the organic black dye. Oh my gosh. <sighs> Wait, I need an ally smelter to make the black dye though. Wait, wait, wait a second. So I need an alloy smelter to make organic black dye. And in order to get an alloy smelter, I need an industrial machine chassis, which comes from the industrial dye blend, which you get from organic black dye. Ah, there's a simple alloy smelter which uses a simple machine chassis, which is what we have. Okay, I was looking at the advanced alloy smelter. Okay, that's, I hate it when they have like different ones. Okay, so I need two furnaces, three iron, two stone gears, and a bucket. Seems simple enough. There we go, we got our flippin' simple alloy smelter. Does it need power? Yeah, it does. Holy cow. All right, what was this thing? A machine that I'm never gonna use again? All right, we'll put we'll put both of them in the factory then. <laughs> oh my goodness, that was ridiculous. Jeez, still got it done though. Still got it done. I guess we'll put them over here in case we uh, need them or something one day. So this needs to be powered. So let's go ahead and get some energy conduits, which I need to make more of. God dang! There we go. I put all my extra blocks in this chest too including all the ones that I use for building. Um, there we go. So now in order to make that, I need fused quartz, which is just literally quartz in there and it will turn into fused quartz. Seems pretty simple. So let's just go ahead and put a load of quartz in there. Let's turn these into blocks of quartz. So that way it'll make 64 fused quartz. So that way when I come back to it, I'll have plenty, plenty of fused quartz which I could then use to make my thingy. Oh, it makes four at a time, or three at a time. We literally just need enough for one pipe because we need the one pipe for the sludge refiner. <laughs> uh, come on, come on. Why are we out of power? Grid is overloaded. Is it nighttime? Ah, uh, okay, what happens is, um. We really, really need to get some more grid power, basically. Cause that's, that's our biggest bottleneck right now. We need more grid power. We need more grid power. So let's put that on the to-do list. Uh, we pretty much have these now. Grid power. Because at night, the stuff will not work because the grid power is what keeps it kind of like a float. You know what I mean? And when we don't have any grid power, it just doesn't work. All right, we got our fused quartz. And I think we have 
tons of conduit binder in our factory. So this should be pretty sick. Let's check it out real quick. We need six. There we go. That's seven, but whatever. Pressurized fluid conduits. Heck yes. Let's put all that in there. Don't worry about it later. So let's check this out now, guys. This is a, these are actually just as cool. <laughs> they're they're Ender IO fluid conduits. Of course they're sick. So let's go ahead and plug this bad boy into here. And what we do is we go to here. We go to extract. Always on. Then insert. Always active. And now it'll take all the sludge in there, and this will just immediately make random stuff that sludge makes. Boom. Really fast, too, I might add. So basically, sludge makes, um, I'll show you, sludge. It's just, uh, just a byproduct, and all it does is it, uh, what does it make you? It is used in a sludge refiner to make clay, clay, dirt, gravel, mycelium, and podsol, sand, red sand, soul sand. So it's actually stuff that we might use eventually. Like clay, you know what I mean? We use clay like all the time. I need to make a, a drawer for these. So this I'm actually going to plug into the uh, the main line. So there you go. And then we can set this to extract, always active. And then that will just go in back into our factory. There you go, it's already all executed. Executed, extracted. And now this is all getting extracted too. Let's check out our drawers, see how they're doing up here. Look at that. We're getting loads, so I can set up an auto crafter for the coal, because that all that coal, all this stuff is used for is to make uh, just coal. Like eight of it makes twelve coal, guys. We're gonna have an absurd amount of coal. It's gonna be fantastic. It's gonna be, it's gonna be huge. It's gonna be huge. So let's go make some drawers for these real quick. I kind of want to make the seeds for these really quick. So this one is um, where's the seed? Here we go. So it's supremium. Ooh. It's actually tier four. I don't know if we have enough. We probably do. Oh, yeah, actually we do. Yeah, we have five, but... Oh, I don't know, though. I don't know, though. Let's take a load of this and turn it into the, the higher tier stuff. Let's see if we can get enough. Oh, we do have enough. I mean, we have plenty. It's just without making another crystal. So if I do that, 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 that. There we go. Turn it into the tier three crafting seed. The tier four crafting seed. There we... Oh, there we go. And then I need... Dark steel right here. Boom, some dark steel seeds. Pretty crazy. So then these guys can be used with tier two, which is much easier. But unfortunately we broke our crystal. So we kind of need to make a new one, which means we need a diamond and uh, four of those. There we go. So I believe it's like this, four of these and like that. Is it not? Maybe it's like this. Yeah, there we go. So let's go ahead and make some more tier two essence. We're actually gonna need a load of this because we're gonna be making all of the tier two seeds. So I might as well turn as much of this into this as I can. There we go. So let's go ahead and uh, turn these seeds into tier two crafting seeds. Boom, there we go. And then that, and then grains of infinity. There we go, boom, grains of infinity seeds. Pretty sick, pretty, pretty, pretty fantastic. Let's put the rest of this stuff away. So dark steel, and we'll need grades of infinity as a spot. We'll put this uh, right there. It's kind of cool looking, isn't it? Dark steel, we can put, uh, what's that, boron? Yeah, we could put it next to boron. Sure, why not? Let's put the rest of this stuff away. We don't really need it. So these crystals, I think I'll just keep them in here, actually, because they don't really work because they have a durability value, so their value does So when I put them in there, they won't go into their slot right here kind of annoying but it's just kind of how it works because it's technically a different value oh I need that there we go so let's go ahead and get some sticks because I want to make some more uh, of these there we go crop sticks we probably have a bunch over there but whatever let's make some more let's check it out because I think we, we yeah I need to do those last three we have three more spots until we need to start expanding which I'm excited for <laughs> actually I don't even know if that thing can reach over here, I don't think it can. <laughs> so we need to set it up on the other side of the farm too. Definitely gotta get that going soon. There we go, put the dark steel seeds here and the grains of infinity seeds there. So we're gonna have to make some more 
lily pads. We're going to have to expand the farm. We're going to have to pretty much just continue working on this farm. This farm is going to be, it's going to be, it's going to be pretty important. It's going to be pretty fantastic. We'll put some more of those in there. It's going to be amazing, guys. I can't wait. I can't wait. And with that, it looks like the sun is setting once again. And I think it's time that we end this session. I hope you all enjoyed some amazing Minecraft. We'll go ahead and uh, set up the uh, four expand farm. There we go. Done. So I'll see you all in the next one, Z fam. Have a fantastic day.